Hey guys, it's B. It's KC. And welcome back to the Time Traveling Toaster event in The Simpsons Tapped Out. This is going to be the very first personal prize in this Act 1 of this major event, and I'm a little bit behind, actually. So far, I just haven't got a chance to play this much. It's Tuesday, by the way, as I'm recording this. I don't know, this will probably be up on Wednesday? Maybe Wednesday? But anyway, that's enough of that. Let's place this down. Ooh. It actually looks like it could be a normal size, like mammoth or elephant, right? You know, sometimes the scaling in this game isn't exactly the best. It can go right there. Look, Stampy, it's your great, great, great grandfather. Long, long elephant trumpet. <laughs> That's a horse. Okay, okay, you're a different species. Thanks for the biology lesson. I was just making conversation. It really was a horse. What? Lisa, if you needed to outsmart a primitive cave person raised in an environment of complete ignorance, what would you do? You're smarter than a caveman. You just gotta be. I know, I'll crush him with a rock. I take that back. I suppose I could get him drunk, expose him to a modern high-tech alcohols, let him make a fool of himself. How needlessly complex. Give it a shot. My coma learn I leave a keg for caveman Artie. This is part of the main quest line, by the way. What the and we're gonna continue doing that. Here we go. Now, there's not a lot to this video, but, 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 we will get a chance to check out this mammoth here, see if it does make a sound. Does a mammoth make the same sound as an elephant? Nope, it doesn't do anything. I mean, it's just a statue. Although, some golden statues make that, you know, golden -y sound or whatever that they've done in the game. Not in this case, though, it would make a lot of sense. Unless it's an exhibit that actually, you know, you press a button or something and it makes a sound. Like, they have that in museums and stuff. Like, dinosaur exhibits? They do! Anyway, I guess that's, that's pretty much it. There's not a lot to really show ya. Next up is gonna be the free land token. Keep in mind with the free land token, if you don't know how it works, I mean, it does as it's advertised, but you just have to click a plot of land, and then you can use the token. So obviously, common sense is to use it on the most expensive one. By the way, there is new land as well. I did not realize that. Check it out. See? They've added new land in this update. So it goes all the way up to... Just keeps going, doesn't it? Three... Three point... Something. Uh... Three point two fifty million. That's, that's totally what I meant to say. But it's a lot of money. Three point two million. Alrighty, so before we wrap it up, we are gonna do some digging. That sounds fun, doesn't it? I don't know, I mean, I've got quite a few dug already. I mean, there's some rock there, so I assume that's it over there on the left. Hooray, I'm out of shovels! Back to work! You never know when we might uncover a Tyrannosaurus! You know it, man. So, we're just tapping some stuff. I don't know why I'm really making this video longer than it has to be. Probably because I haven't got a chance to really play, so... You guys get to watch me play, because I haven't got a chance to log in much at all. Today, on Tuesday. Did I say that already? Probably. Ah, yes. Isn't this enjoyably fun? Capabies and dinos. What am I up to? I'm almost up to 10,000. Oh, this is done. Send excavators to acquire shovels. So this is done. Boom. What am I up to? I'm up to 12,000. Alright, that's not bad. I'm hoping to get to the free land token today, actually. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, and share. Thanks for watching. My name is Casey, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye, guys.